Okay, for 8a, they're going to give you a function. They want you to tell whether it's even, odd, or near. They want you to classify that. So here's the, the rules for even, odd, or neither. If you put a negative x in to the function, and the result is you get exactly the same function as what you started with, we say that that's going to be even. If you put a negative into the function and you get exactly the same function but with a negative sign out front, then this is classified as odd. And if you don't get any of that that happens when you plug in negative x, that means it's going to be neither. Okay, so for this one right here, uh, we want to go ahead and put in a negative. We're going to find out what f of negative x is. So I have negative, I put negative x in there for all the x's. Just like that. And let's simplify it. So that means that I get, okay, now negative is going to come out because of the cube here, so that's going to change that sign to a positive. So I get positive x cubed on the bottom, negative squared, that's actually going to go away, and, and I just get this as a result. So what, I'm, so what I got was f of negative x is equal to x cubed over 3x squared minus 9. Now, let's look at the original one. Notice that it looks like exactly the same as the original one, except that there's a minus sign difference. So this actually is saying that f of negative x, I can conclude now from what I wrote out here, uh, that f of negative x is equal to negative f of x. If I take this one here and I multiply it by a negative, then that means I get exactly the same thing that I got here. So therefore, because of that, what I would put here is, for the answer, this one is odd. Okay, for 8b, we have this one again, classified as even, odd, or neither. So like I showed for uh, the first one, for a, we always want to find f of negative x first. So if we, get, if we do f of negative x and we get the same thing we started with, it's even. If we get the same thing we started with with a negative out front, it's going to be odd. So let's do that for this one. Find f of negative x. Going to put negative x in for x in the original one. And we just need to simplify this one. So negative x, we're squaring that. You're going to get cube root of 2x squared minus 3 because the negative, anytime you have a negative raised to an even power, uh, it goes away. But if you have a negative raised to an odd power, uh, then it remains. Okay, so for this case, it would go away. Now notice what I got. I got the original one. So now what, I, what ended up happening was f of negative x caused me to get f of x. And that definition, that's the definition for uh, even. So for this particular problem, for 8b, uh, this particular function is classified as even.